Beretta has a tested and tried reputation in the gun market. It's not just another gun manufacturer. First, it's the oldest gun manufacturer in the world. Second, it's the oldest industrial company of any kind. I think it was around 1526 when it started constructing Arquibus barrels. Admittedly, I know a guy or two who dislikes Beretta guns. I'm also aware that there are criticisms lingering around some of Beretta's recent creations. Despite this, I think it's not an exaggeration that Beretta is one of the most reputable gun makers out there. This video will be proof of that. Hello everyone, this is Ted from Line45. In this video, I compiled five of Beretta's most impressive guns throughout the years. These are the very firearms that cemented the reputation and legacy of the brand in the gun industry. Before we get underway, please remember to hit the like and subscribe buttons. I know it is a chore, but these simple clicks help my channel immensely. Now, let's return to the video. Beretta APX If we are just going to limit ourselves to Beretta, then the Beretta APX is the best 9mm handgun there is, and there's a lot of story behind this pistol that made its reputation well-known among shooting enthusiasts. You see, this is the very entry Beretta submitted for the XM-17 handgun trials. In short, they had the U.S. military test the APX and see whether or not it had the qualities that would make it their next standard sidearm. Of course, we already knew that the Sig Sauer P320 bagged that contract, but this doesn't mean that the APX is a shabby pistol. In fact, it's the contrary. The Beretta APX is currently one of the best-selling handguns of Beretta. After it failed the trials, Beretta decided to introduce it on the market, and fortunately, it was received with wide, open arms. The double-action APX is a polymer-framed pistol and is designed with striker-fired capabilities. You can really say that this is an Italian version of a Glock pistol, and it has some design details that somehow allow it to stand out. As a part of the military requirement, the APX offers modular backstraps, so it's really, really possible to configure its grip. Whether you have small or large hands, the APX of Beretta will give you a good fit. It also comes with ambidextrous slide release elvers and swappable magazine releases. It has the ergonomics that many top-of-the-line 9mm handguns have. Notably, its grip housing has subtle finger grooves that, in practice, should give you a comfortable and firm shooting grip. Meanwhile, its slide is definitely grippy, so you can actually rack it or do press checks without any difficulties. The APX is available in different variants. You are free to buy its base model, or you can get tactical options that feature red dot capabilities and extended barrels. By the way, the base model is about 7.5 inches long and comes with a 4.25 inch barrel. It has a nice height of 5.6 inches, which offers a more generous real estate on its grip. Its trigger isn't custom quality, but it isn't bad either. Plus, with its capacity of 17 plus one rounds, the APX is definitely designed for prolonged battles. Beretta 92X Compact My next entry on this list is the Beretta 92X Compact. It is one of the recent Beretta creations. I think it was launched in 2220 or 2021, so it's definitely a new kid on the block. Essentially, the Beretta 92X lineup is a fresh take on the venerable Beretta 92. It has the iconic performance of its predecessor but offers more modernized features that cater to the growing demands of present-day shooters. Needless to say, the Beretta 92X Compact is the concealed carry variant of the 92X. I'm not certain, but I assume that this is the only concealed carry option for this particular product line. It's worth buying the Beretta 92X Compact. It has outstanding features, such as its perfectly fitted frame and slide. Speaking of, it is equipped with a Centurion slide, which is also a recent configuration introduced by Beretta. The 92X Compact comes with a 4.25-inch barrel and has a carrying capacity of 13 plus 1 rounds. It's chambered in 9mm, by the way. If you think that this number is too low, there are aftermarket magazines for the 92X Compact, with some reaching up to 15 plus 1 rounds. In contrast to the original Beretta 92, several design improvements are present in the 92X series. Of course, this means that all Beretta 92X guns provide better performance and capabilities. The classic slide is replaced by the Vertex slide, and this slide is equipped with dovetailed front and rear sights. Speaking of, the front sight of the 92X is a high-visibility orange insert. It allows for faster sight acquisition, 
regardless of the lighting conditions. It's also worth noting that it comes with a shave grip housing. This design allows for a more natural and straighter grip, just like what you have with the M9A3. Moreover, it shortens the distance of the trigger, enabling you to shoot the pistol easily. The beaver tail of the 92X Compact has reduced beaver tail. I guess that's for easier concealment. You also have the option to get this gun with or without its Picatinny rail. Beretta 92FS, Beretta M9. I am sure that some of you have guessed this entry because, really, are there any Beretta guns that could top the 92F or M9 in terms of popularity? The M9 was the pistol adopted by the United States Army as its standard issue sidearm, effectively replacing the battle-tested 45 ACP M1911 pistols. It is a double-action semi-automatic pistol that served the armed forces for over three decades or 33 years to be exact. As a military gun, the Beretta M9 showcased guaranteed reliability and proficiency in combat and practice. It was only in 2017 that the M9 was replaced by the Sig Sauer P320, or Sig Sauer M17, which is also a semi-automatic pistol chambered in 9mm. But during this time, the M9, or the Beretta 92F, has already established itself as one of the most user-friendly, accurate, and reliable pistols in the gun market. Even other law enforcement agencies, such as the NYPD Emergency Services and LAPD, have acknowledged the quality of the gun. It's not just easy to shoot it is also easy to maintain. Basically, you can disassemble or assemble the firearm without the need for any tools. At the same time, it has ambidextrous controls that cater to a number of shooters. Meanwhile, the Beretta FS is the civilian designation of the Beretta M9. It comes with a 5.2-inch threaded barrel for added stability and recoil management when firing. It is also equipped with an accessory rail for mounting flashlights and accessories in case you want to get a tactical setup. Furthermore, the tritium night sights provide foolproof target visibility, whether it's dark or night. It's better than other stock sights, so much so that it requires no replacement or upgrades. Its standard capacity is 17 plus 1, but in states with restrictions, this one arrives with a 10 plus 1 capacity. Even if the Beretta M9 isn't the newest gun in Beretta's arsenal, it is still a pistol you need to check out. It's the one that put Beretta on the pedestal while serving as the cornerstone of modern full-size firearms. Beretta PX4 Storm Compact. The Beretta PX4 Storm Compact is a prolific choice for a concealed carry gun. I mean, this one isn't always mentioned, but this particular pistol has all that it takes to keep you safe and well-equipped throughout the day. Technically speaking, there are other compact pistols that provide better performance, quality, and architecture than the PX4 Storm Compact. It isn't your high-value handgun per se, but within the ranks of the Beretta pistols, this one stands out. Don't get me wrong, though, it can still compete with some of the best compact handguns out there. The key premise of the Beretta PX4 Storm Compact is the perfect blend of traditional hardware and modern design specs. So, what you really get is a modernized double-action, jock, single-action gun that features a polymer frame. As we all know, polymer frames already dominate the gun market these days, so it's not surprising that the PX4 Storm Compact follows the same trend. Aside from its lightweight frame, its slide is easy to rack and maneuver. There's nothing really impressive about the slide, but I can assure you that it doesn't disappoint. Meanwhile, the operating system of the PX4 Storm is pretty much the same as the Beretta 92. It comes with decocking safety levers mounted on its slide. Housed in the gun is a rotating 3.27-inch barrel. I know this is a bit short, but keep in mind that this design is intentional. Anyway, I have zero problems with its barrel. It's not shaky and still gives the pistol the reliability and accuracy expected from it. Interestingly, there's an accessory rail integrated into this gun where you can mount accessories like lights and lasers. I also have to tell you that the Beretta PX4 Storm Compact is very fun to shoot. Aside from its almost perfect reliability, the gun has a smooth trigger pull you can pull it to the back without hints of stacking. Of course, this is essential for every double action trigger. In fact, I believe that it's the best DA trigger within its price point. I might be wrong, but it's really, really good. And to top that good stuff, the Beretta PX4 Storm Compact offers a similar capacity as the Beretta 92FS. It holds 15 plus one rounds of nine millimeter. Keep in mind that this is a significantly smaller pistol than the FS, so that alone proves the innovation Beretta poured over this little beast. 92X Performance Optic Ready. 
The 92X Performance Optic Ready variant is perhaps the finest creation of Beretta as of late. This one was launched during the 2022 USPSA National Championships, so it really acquired lots of attention. But the base 92X performance has been launched earlier. I think that it was during the SHOT Show 2020 that I was able to take a glimpse at this work of art. It has an all-steel frame, and its construction was really meant for competition. Right from the box, you no longer need to upgrade it. It can shoot with exceptional quality, with no break-in period needed. It also comes with checkering on its front and back straps and features fiber optic front sight and extended controls. It even uses a Brigadier slide, which screams quality and ergonomics. Several years later, Beretta introduced the 92X Performance Optic Ready model. Compared to the defensive models of Beretta, the slide of the Performance Optic Ready model doesn't feature any slide lightning. It has just been optimized to make it into the weight class of the IDPA. Most of the features of this pistol are the same as its predecessors. It has a fiber front sight and an adjustable rear sight. There's still also the front and rear cocking serrations. The serrations are aggressive enough that you can manipulate its slide even when there's an optic mounted. Meanwhile, its vertex steel frame has a full rail dust cover to further optimize its weight. It's also worth noting that this gun has a high beaver tail, which is then complemented by its front and rear strap checkering. With these design cues, the 92X Performance Optic Ready model is surprisingly easy to control, even if it weighs around 48 ounces. You'll also love its contoured and flared magazine, well that ensures a fast, convenient reload. Its oversized magazine release is accessible and can be reversed. If you have the bucks, this competition-ready gun from Beretta is an excellent investment to take in 2024. It's fast, accurate, and extremely reliable. It can hit a thousand rounds with zero malfunctions. Thanks for watching. If you want to see more gun videos like this, just click the subscribe button and notification bell. Take care and stay safe. Care and stay safe. Care.